Yeah, I'll react to that, sure. Okay. Hi. My name's Connor. I like to watch stuff on YouTube. Hit all the buttons. Original link to the video, top of the description, right below that, link to the Discord. Click on it, send you right over there. We'd love to have you join the community over there. The more the merrier. They're nice. Us no, they're not. Usually. Sometimes. You can make it better. Um, Sean Bean. Double Sean Bean. Jesus, doppelganger Sean Bean. Uh, so they're on the, this is Napoleonic Wars. During the Napoleonic Wars, uh, anyone's new. They are on the Iberian Peninsula, I believe. They have to be, either in Spain or Portugal. Annihilates the French attack. Let's do it. Hope you're all doing swell. Uh, did I say, let's go. We'll fire five rounds. No more, no less. Okay. You'll shoot officers and NCOs. Then when you count your ammunition, every man will have 13 rounds left. Fire in your own time. I, uh, let me restart. Let me restart. I just, I wasn't in the thing, okay? And why are they using older artillery cannons? I thought they, okay. Ah. We'll fire five rounds. No more, no less. You'll shoot officers and NCOs. Then when you count your ammunition, every man will have 13 rounds left. Fire in your own time. Throw! Pick up the standard. Pick up the standard.
C'était terrible, non Oui, général. Encore plus terrible que Moscou. Alors, ça devait être vraiment terrible. On a perdu. On a perdu. On a perdu. So, I have a lot of questions. I'm going to go in reverse order. The grave it great, as always. Love the sharp clips. He said worse than Alors, Moscow. Ça vraiment terrible. Or non. as bad as Et Moscow. Encore plus terrible. I thought, and I, 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 I haven't learned about the Napoleonic Wars enough, okay? I have a bit through videos, right? Reactions. But... I thought all of the stuff going on, you know, British. The British uh, landing and fighting on the Iberian Peninsula occur occurred after Napoleon's retreat from Moscow. Okay, so this guy was in Moscow and he made it all the way back and he's the one who made it. Okay, so this is after that. Um, I have, I had a few questions. Um, oh, like for one, uh, the cannons they use, and then I want to get to the, the point out the standards. These look like, like the earliest forms of cannons, like in our, and artillery, you know, you know, like the, the short barreled, um, uh, you know, the really short barreled cannons, you know, I, I didn't know they were in you. I, I thought it was deemed, you know, less advanced than, than, you know, the standard Napoleonic war cannons that they use. And I, I didn't know there were more modern versions. Modern, I meaning by their standards, like modern compared to, you know, the 13, 14, 1500s when, you know, they were first using cannons. And. I, I didn't know they had short-barreled ones. Maybe it's used for, like, buckshot, but they weren't using it for buckshot. And look at the the balls they're firing. Maybe they maybe they were. I mean, they, they look like they have places to attach chains, and then you can link two balls together and then fire it and have it, like... <laughs> um, and uh, a great touch was all the, the men constantly picking up the standard until they didn't. See, they always pick up the standard, right? The flag. And I, I, that's funny. That's cool because I'd always remember learning in, uh, like learning about Napoleonic War battles or, you know, battles before or after that. And I was always confused how they would enter battle banners, standards, flags, you know, uh, these things right here, right? Uh, they would include those in, in, um, Casualty statistics, right? It'd be like, you know, forty-five, like four thousand five hundred men lost, you know, two thousand wounded, um, fifty guns lost, and then it'd be like two banners lost or standards lost. And I'm like, why? Why would you include a flag in the? Why is that worthy of being noted in the casualty in like the losses list? And obviously, it's because there's there's a lot of pride in uh, the standard, and having it taken is a really big shame. 
and it's a big symbol for the whole regiment or battalion company whatever whatever you want to call this um and uh yeah that that was a cool touch for sure that they they kept picking up the stand oh, until they didn't People trying to come back. No, no, sir. And uh, there was definitely one more thing I wanted to say. Maybe there. Oh, yeah. What was this? What were they doing here? Is this just like chalk powder? At first, I'm like, they don't have chemical weapons or something. And like, it looks like they were the, the soldiers were like reacting to like a, a gas attack almost. But is that just like super, super powdery chalk or something that is easily irritated in your eyes and and your mouth and trouble breathing and, and whatnot. So if anyone knows exactly what this white powder stuff they're using to dump on the French is, I'd really like to know that. Awesome. I love watching these clips. All right. Uh, love you guys. Hope you're doing well. Hope you enjoyed that and can teach me some, or can answer some of my questions in the comments. Looking forward to it. And uh, again, if you want to join the discord, that's up to you. Just makes it easier for me to interact with you and, and whatnot, you know? I'll see you guys next time. All right. Bye, guys.